All right, so it is the next day. I downloaded the save editor from Cure's Discord that they graciously provided. Uh, I did a test run with it a minute ago and it seems to work. So I am just going to try it again and hopefully it works the same. So we pop in in Hollow Basin, which is weird. Uh, I want to put this on there. As you can see, we have three black books. I'm going to put it over there. We're going to warp to the archives. I'm going to hop down. I'm going to talk to Daedalus. So that didn't work. And I'm not sure why. Pop in in Hollow Basin. Warp to the Forbidden Archive. Make sure the Black Book is on. Do I have to use it? Is that what it is? It doesn't seem to be it. So we currently have zero black books. Hi. I don't know why it worked one time and then I went to recreate it and now it's not working. No idea what it did. Exit. Um. Up in the hollow basin. What is that? Um, what are those items that I saw there? That seems weird. Uh, 
empty. Put the black books on. Go over to the black books. Warp over to the Forbidden Archives. Hello, Strife. I have finished reading the book you gave me. It was well deserving of its ink. I do not think its knowledge should be shared. It spoke of an ancient stage play about a king of sorts who... I'm sorry. Even this knowledge couldn't part evil omens against you. Here. Take this ring instead. It is the most powerful magic I've come across. You'll find it's a great trade for that book. I think I'm going to travel soon, but it's been nice to talk with you, Strife. Until we meet again. All right, we got it. We can go ahead and save. Oh, it takes a long time. Fine, you die. Okay. Didn't seem to do much damage to this guy. I wonder if it will do a lot of damage to Saxarius. So let's go try that real quick. It is 11.36 p.m. I have to be up in six, seven hours. Plenty of time, right, guys? Five dollars. Let me take you off. And let us save so we don't have to go through any of that shit again. And let's warp to the Foreign Arena. All right, we have to remember to dodge the corpse this time. Do not let me forget to dodge the corpse. Oh, you're alive, Strife? Well, don't interfere. Glorious violence shall be mine.
don't think it's as good as I was hoping. jump. Might be time to pop that last ocean elixir. I was saving it for a special occasion, and I think the occasion has come. Is that stage two or? I think the I think if I just invest in some health pots, I might just be able to beat him. Just the investing in health pots. So what we can do, let's work back. I really want to kill this guy.
Is there another spell that I could use? I don't think so. No, thank you. No, thank you. I've been trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. Oh. Your live strife will don't interfere. Glorious violence shall be mine. Not particular. I meant to put antidote on as well, and then I forgot. Hope if I didn't get hit by everything. I have not seen you do that before. That doesn't seem very fair. Come on.
I'm playing really badly. Come on. Come on. Do what you're going to do. Do the jump. What are you? I didn't see you last time. Press jump. I think I'm dead. I don't want to sleep. It's not my bedtime. Make sure we have an antidote on as well. I do wish that you could skip this.
Not particularly. Let's jump. Oh my god, come on. I don't think that was fair. I can't even tell how much the moonbeam is doing, but I know that it's more than the fairies were, so...
I'm doing my best. I disagree. Holding to the left. Please move. Okay. You are not alone.
Wait, is Clive the knight? Do I get to keep the sword? The sword is awesome. The Unkillable Curse. Defeat Cursed Knight Sixarius. Uh, hi, guys. Uh, thank you. Uh, where did the knight go? Hey, Strife. You made it. One chamber is all that's left. Maybe it's finally time to wake it up. I'll meet you there when you're ready. Calamus is already waiting there. See ya. Whoa, I'm beat. Sorry. Sorry I got stuck outside that mass of fire. I was able to buff your health and mana from outside it, though. I guess Sixarius wasn't killable after all. Although I do admit, I don't quite understand what death is. For some, it seems to be more about rebirth or change. Maybe Sixarius is still out there in the universe. Maybe he'll get a new chance at life. Or maybe this is all we have. What happens to those in dreams when the dream is ended? Sorry, I didn't mean to get philosophical. It's just nice to voice my thoughts with you, Strife. I'll meet you back at Wing's Rest. Wow, wow, wow. A cursed night indeed. I've hunted many a foe claimed unkillable, but this sure was something else. Without his curses, he could finally die. Truly, he suffered a tormented existence. It's far better this way. You can go ahead if you want to wake the Great One. I've seen enough for today. Uh, can I go save? Are you... Grot the Hound. Oh, hello, Strife. It seems I was quite unmatched, wasn't I? I don't really know what will happen to me now. I can't die, but I've never lost so much of myself before. You go on ahead. I don't think I'm cut out for this after all. I might just sleep a little. Hmm. Can I go save? I want to go save. So I don't have to do that fight ever again. Until I decide that I'm going to speedrun this game or something. Recording looks good, voice looks good, sound looks good.
The sword looks fucking awesome. Is the lucid blade made made out of the same material as the the crystals? Is there going to be another boss in here? Are they going to reuse the Serena or? Grave of the Sleeper. Interesting. Oh, hey, it's down there on the shore. I'm not sure what will happen when it wakes up. All I know is that the great well and the era created by it will all be brought to an end. There's no going back once it's awake. At least not as this world is now. But sometimes the end is just a new beginning. Uh, Clive, you look fucking awesome. Welcome to the end, Strife. The Great One is right down there, deathly sleeping on the same shore it was born on. There was a time long ago when I caressed it back to sleep. I would have done anything to extend its slumber, to have the world live just a little longer. But I agree now, it must be awakened. Its dream has gone on long enough. What is up, Bergatoth? Lunacid, woke the old one, achieved the true end. Alright, 
so that was the first ending, and we still have our shinobi. Uh, that's fucking awesome. All right. So that's the first ending. I'm going to try to go back and get other endings. Um, I would like to play other games as well, but I know that you guys have been waiting for this. Let's do this. Uh, my room is a little bit messy. Please don't mind it. Um, that was the first ending. I know that there are two other endings, I think. Um, global achievements. Ending E, ending CD. So there are two other endings. I'm going to try to go through and get those at some later date. We also need to do the um, the tower. Is that what it was? Challenge tower. Uh, we need to do that. Um, I would like to get all of the achievements in this game since it looks like uh, I don't have that many left. Uh, I don't know if I'll do that in a video or not. But um, yeah, this was amazing. I put 20 hours into it. 20 one hours into it. Um, I was uh, not really happy about the bug that uh, uh, moon, Moonbeam, uh, I really would like to see a fix for that because that seemed a little bit uh, weird, um, incongruous with the rest of the game. Um, I did not like the uh, the last one that we did. What was the last area that we did? The Ash Maze, the, ma the Labyrinth of Ash. Um, I just thought of the ashtray maze, maze from uh, Control and how amazing that was. Um, the Labyrinth of Ash, uh, you go through it, you've got those manta ray things. Uh, they're really tanky. You've got the centaurs, they're really tanky. Um, you go through, you do the trial and error maze in order to get the book, and then it just says unintelligible. There's not really a clue for it as far as I could see. Uh, maybe I just missed it. Uh, that, I think, was probably the weakest area. Uh, I loved the um, the new areas, the, um, the Egyptian area. Can't remember what it was called. Uh, I liked the um, Ruined Arena. Uh, that was pretty cool. And the Sixarians, uh, that was really nice. Um, it was a cool little preview for what you were going to fight. Um, I think that the final boss needs to be rebalanced, but I'm not sure how. Because uh, it felt like he wasn't really conducive for melee builds. Um, and I carried the... Um, the shooty shooty, the double uh, crossbow, most of the uh, game. Uh, and it worked for most enemies up until you got to the Labyrinth of Ash and uh, Sixarius. Um, so it would be nice if there was some way to like keep the weapon I had been using the whole game uh, rather than having to pivot to a new build. Um, the other thing is that I kind of feel like I should have been leveling magic. Uh, it feels like magic would have been a better... Um, more long-term weapon, long-term build. Uh, I wonder if magic is kind of easy mode in this game. I don't want to try it. I want to keep uh, working with a mixture of melee weapons and magic. Um, but yeah, uh, the ending was great. Um, Chef's kiss, uh, moi. Uh, I loved that ending. Uh, the transition from the old one into like the real world, the uh, FMV footage. Uh, that was cool. Um, I am super pumped up and now I've got to go to sleep because I've got to work in the morning. Um, so yeah, that was really cool. Um, I liked the uh, the segment with Demi, uh, Demi and Cheryl and Etna popping out of nowhere and being like, you're not alone, like we're your friends, we've been with you this whole way. Um, and it's it's really cool because we got to learn about Etna and we found their body. Uh, we got to learn about Cheryl. We found their um, uh, little, uh, I can't remember the guy's name, the, the knight in the armor. Uh, and we got to free it for them. 
Uh, and then Clive being like a warrior, like not just uh, a skeleton with a crown, but an actual like knight Calumnus who sealed away the, the awakened one. Um, all of that. So cool. Uh, it was everything that I wanted out of that ending. Uh, very good. Um, yeah, I think I have raved about it enough. Um, I'm going to get out of here, look for more Lunacid videos in the future while I just achievement hunt. Um, and then we will go from there. Uh, I'm not sure what I want to do next. I don't think I want to do Observation Duty 6 because it's going to be a lot of content. I would rather do something smaller, uh, but I don't know what I want to do yet. I'd like to do something um, small that I could get out in one, and two, one or two videos so I don't have to go through and edit a big video. Um, but yeah. All right. I have not done my sign off in a very long time. Uh, good night. Thank you for joining me on this adventure. I love you. And I will see you again real soon.